Hello everyone, a special thank you to Tony in Phoenix, Arizona. This is FreePrescriptionLenses.com where everyone loves a bargain and no one is disappointed with quality. I am the hardest working optician in the industry as well as the most famous on the internet. My name is C. More Better, but call me Mo, Mo Better, because I'm going to have you see Mo Better, look at Mo Better, and show everyone else how I bring that loving feeling back to glasses when I show you Tony's Oakley 9329. This is the SI standard issue ballistic shock tube. These are OSHA approved safety glasses. It comes in several colors. He's getting color 01, the matte black. Comes in one size, the 61 eye size. Now I'll have a link in the description below as well as at the end of this frame that'll take you to the website so you can see all the colors. The 01 comes with a silver Oakley emblem. The 05 comes with a red Oakley emblem. You're going to get the Carrying, cloth, carrying bag doubles as a cleaning cloth. That's what comes with the safety glasses. You get the original demo lenses. And these can only come with an OSHA stamp in the upper corner of outside of each lens, making them legal on any federal job site. Now, Tony, who lives in Phoenix, Arizona, if there's anyone who needs the new Transitions Extract of Polarized Gray, it is him. In Arizona, you get your own personal sun that follows you around wherever you go. So this lens has only been available for a couple months. You've heard of the Transitions Extra Active, but from Zeiss I can get them with the Extra Active Polarized Gray, and gray only. It only comes in the one color, but nine times out of ten everyone gets the gray. So it also feels the darkest, but this is what they look like indoors. It's amazing how clear they are indoors. Years ago the Transitions Extra Active retained so much more color, but they don't. So I'm going to do this a few times. You hear the term polar opposites. When you look, I have a polarized lens. When you hold it over one and rotate it 90 degrees, it'll go pitch black, but you can see the light through both of those lenses. Let me go ahead and activate these. Now, it takes about 30 to 45 seconds for the lenses to darken when you go outside. A little bit longer when you come back inside. 45 seconds to a minute, minute 15. Now, Tony and everyone else, pay attention. All photochromic lenses will get dark on day one and continue to darken every day for the first couple weeks they're exposed to the sun. After that, they will work for years at maximum performance. The only time they won't work 100% is if you're behind the windshield of a car. Your windshield absorbs the sun's harmful ultraviolet rays that would cause your dashboard to crack from sitting in the sun all day, and that's why they don't turn dark in a car. Now, having said that, these new Transitions Extra Active will get 30 to 50% dark behind a car windshield. Now, you see me, you can see through the lens. When I turn it 90 degrees, it goes pitch black. That's how you can tell it's polarized. You can see through the lens, turn it 90 degrees, it goes pitch black. Now, the, they're also temperature sensitive, meaning they will get darker when it's 85 and below than they will when it's 95 and above. But I remind everyone, when it's 100 degrees outside, you're miserable, they're miserable, nobody or nothing works 100% when it's 100 degrees outside. We all work much better when it cools off. Having said that, these transitions extract to polarize will work, get darker in hotter weather. So if you live in a hot climate, California, Texas, Arizona, Florida, or if you just want the darkest lens possible, so let's do it now that it's uh, the lens is about 50%. You can see through it, rotate it, it's still blocking about 90% of the rays, even at 50% dark. So, but yeah, these are these will get darker in hotter weather. Now the other nice thing that Tony may not need, but anyone else listening, photochromic lenses were the original blue blocking lenses. So not everyone got a photochromic. Photochromic just means self-tinting. Goes from clear inside to dark outside, then back to clear when you go back inside. They block, the original blue blocking lenses were the photochromic. They block 30 to 50% of the harmful blue light that you hear spoken about emitted from today's electronic devices such as cell phones, tablets, computer screens. And of course, the number one source of blue light on the planet, anyone, anyone, Bueller, that's right, the sun, the source of life or life on this planet. But these extra active will block 50 to 70 percent of the harmful blue light. The Zeiss Photofusion gray, brown, green, and blue in the Transitions Gen 8 block th um, 30 to 50 percent. These will block, the extra active will block 50 to 70. So you can still see some of the light is starting to come through. But look how much polarization it still does, how much light it blocks in there. And again, these are getting close to the original indoor color. And it's still block, it's still acting as polarized. So 
even if it's 30 to 50 percent behind a windshield which is more than this look how much polarization still works even at the lighter color I'm, it's all the lights coming through now it's not all the lights coming through now that's how much polarization is still left now polarized ray the same way you can skip a stone off of water, light does the same thing. It hits a flat surface and reflects back up off of roads, bumpers, windshields, and of course off of water. Fishermen love that. With polarized lenses, you can look directly into the water. You don't see the reflection of uh, the trees on the other side of the lake. So the polarized were originally invented for the U.S. Navy who was getting so much glare off the water when they were on the deck of the ship. So they came up with these lenses and it blocks so much more glare than just a tinted lens. Now nothing against the Transitions Extra Active or any of the other photochromic lenses that were sold. They're just a tinted lens, just like an Easter egg. You take a clear lens, you drop it in a hot dye and it changes colors. Just like making tie-dye shirts. Remember doing that in college? Who, know, who remembers anything from college? But these, this is a laminate on the front layer of the lens. And so it's like Venetian blinds. It blocks all horizontal glare. So the few times it may be a problem if you're the, um, here, let's grab this. This is a glare source. The, the, you know, a phone. When you hold that over and look through it, sometimes it may go pitch black. There are certain Apple phones, Jigsaw would tell you, there are certain Apple phones that you can't see when you have a polarized lens. But my Android phone works just perfect with a polarized lens, even at full capacity. Let's do this. You can still see the phone, the icons on there. But some people's GPS navigation system, an LCD screen is a glare source. Look, there's, uh, there's Mr. Whiskers, there's Mrs. Whiskers on my phone. Our two adopted new kittens. But uh, the GPS navigation system in vehicles, sometimes, but if that goes black, you just tilt one ear. Imagine the wings of a plane. As long as they're horizontal on the plane, it will block that glare source. But if you tilt your ear towards one shoulder, the navigation screen will become clear. Same for gas pumps. You could be standing pumping gas. It'll look, the LCD screen could look black. Just like when I held this up to the light. That's what it's going to look like. Now they've changed. Now that was more predominant 10 years ago. All the modern electronic companies, that's a jab at Jigsaw, all the modern electronic companies have reversed their polarization of their screens to work with polarized lenses. There's still some outdated companies that have not done that yet. Um, in the 20 years I've been selling polarized lenses, it only seems to be happening rather recently with certain Apple products. I cannot tell you why. But uh, any Android, you will never have that problem. <laughs> Anything that's not a new Apple will never be an issue for you. So, someone was cutting corners somewhere and forgot to do their job along with modern electronics. Their first phones never had that issue. It's only been a recent, recent release of certain Apple products that uh, quality control overlooked. Um, so they certainly took care of all their early phones, early generation phones, never an issue. All right, I'm going to get down off my soapbox. But, um, but yeah, so any time that happens, if you're wearing them, just tilt your ear towards one shoulder and everything will become clear again. That's all you have to do when you're at the gas pumps. Just tilt your head sideways like that and you'll see the screen. Okay, you got that? I'm done clamoring about my little rant there. So, but that's it. Um, if you have any questions, go to the Contact Us page of the website. You can email us directly at freeprescriptionlenses at gmail.com. If you want to get a live operator, call 919-491-2411. Um, he will answer his outdated iPhone 13. <laughs> um, someone chip in and get him an iPhone 4 that will work with polarized lenses. and uh, But he can answer all phone calls if you, uh, he answers... In several languages. He's my apprentice. He's in third year of the apprentice program. You can text in English only. I get all text messages and he gets all phone calls. So let's see. You can also leave a question or comment in the comment section below. But polarized lenses block 30 to 40 percent more glare than just a tinted lens. So polarized block more glare than any current lens on the market. 
And with Tony living in Phoenix, Arizona, he's going to appreciate that. Even when he's driving around in a vehicle, if these are 30 to 50 percent, you saw that it was almost 90 percent polarized. Of course, now they're back to clear. It lets all the light come back through. Amazing new technology. Now, these lenses, the Transitions Extract of Polarize, Polarize adds $198 to the purchase of a frame. You can add any anti-glare you want. He got these as safety glasses, so anti-glare was not really needed. So, that's it. So, again, Tony in Phoenix, Arizona, thank you so much for the purchase of the Oakley 9329 shock tube with your Transition, your OSHA ANSI stamped Transitions Extract of Polarized Gray Lenses. And now hopefully, whoop, remember to click on the link in the corner to take you to the website to see these frames. And hopefully now everyone else has gotten a chance to hear my rant and see how I believe bring that loving feeling back to glasses. Thank you.